What's up pinball fans? My name is Rudy aka Loaded Weapon and tonight I'm going to do a quick video on the uh, Batman 66 tribute table. Okay? Um, so basically uh, you want this table right here, Batman 66 tribute. You want to hit the download section. You want to download the 1.1. Then over here on the right hand side you want to get the putt pack and you want the 1.1 putt pack. Okay? Once you download both of those, then you're going to be ready to install it. But first things first, we're going to check a few things to make sure that your system is set up correctly. And if it isn't, we're going to fix it. Okay? So this will help you in all your tables in the long run. But the first thing you want to do, you want to check, especially if you got NVIDIA or AMD, whatever you have, you want to go to the, your control panel and you want to make sure that your screens are lined up correctly. They need to be lined up across the top as you can see. It does not matter about the number, but the type of screen that you have needs to be in order. So basically what I mean is your play field needs to be your far left. It doesn't matter about the number, but the play field needs to be far right. It needs to be your primary display. Okay. Once After that, you want your uh, back glass, then your DMD, and if you have a topper, then of course that will be after that. Okay. But they need to be lined up evenly across the top, not down here. Okay not up here they all need to be lined up evenly all right once you've did that then you want to check your display settings you want to make sure that they are not scaled past 100 so you're going to click on each one of your monitors you're going to check your scaling and it must be 100 you don't want one zoomed in to 120 150 even if you have a bad eyesight and you you scale it down so you can read something you you can't do it for pinball all right so it must be on 100. All right. So after you've done that, you have all your monitors set up correctly. Then we're going to go into pinup popper. Okay. So we're going to go over here. We're going to go to the pinup popper config. We're going to then go to popper setup at the top. Then we're going to go to screens and theme. And then over here on the right hand side, you want to configure display locations. All right. We're going to click that. And if you have a topper, of course, you're going to have that on your topper. I just have it over here above my, on the top of my DMD. Um, and then you want your DMD. Of course, it's going to be on the DMD. You want your back glass full screen on your back glass. Then you have your play field full screen on your play field. This is where it comes in next. You want the music. This must be on your DMD and full screen. Okay? That'll help you out later on for other putt packs, too. I think... Uh, the monsters maybe I think it uh, I think it uses it there's a few but music on your DMD full screen okay and then of course your full screen needs to be on your DMD full screen alright once you did that you save it you exit it close everything now then you're gonna put your table of course in your tables folder VPN tables and we'll go down here. We got Batman 66. Okay. You put that in there. You're going to back up. You're going to go to your pinup system. You're going to go to pup videos. All right. You're going to have B66. Where is that at? B66 underscore original. This should be your pup pack. You're going to go down and you need to pick the setup that you have. So if you have three screen, you're going to double click this. You're going to hit key to set that up just like that. If you have two screen, you're going to hit that one. Desktop, vice versa. So, three screen, hit it. Now, now that you have that set, now one last thing. Always set up your tables outside of Popper. Okay? You always want to run them in um, VPX first. Get everything set up. Do all your settings. Then you can add it to Popper and, and run it and all that. And also the best thing to do is run it in DirectX. Even though I use um, GL as my main uh, EXE, I use the DirectX version to set all my tables. Just so it's easier to get your mouse and move stuff around and all that. Alright, so we're going to do Batman 66. I'm going to load it up. You're going to click the script button over here on the left. Toggle script editor. Then you're going to go down. And you want to find pinup player user config and these are the main things you want to set uh, of course if you're one screen you have to set it to one screen 
If you're on two screen, you need to set this correctly. For full DMD, it must be on two, okay? If you're on just a small LCD, you can put it on zero. If you have a real DMD, it needs to be on one. But for a full DMD, you must select two. If not, once you start playing, uh, it'll be right at first, and then the DMD will move. You'll be like, where's my DMD going? Okay, that's the reason why. Then you're going to pick if you want it to be on high resolution. We'll go ahead and hit true. Uh, scaling, leave that on zero. And then if you want the videos to play over top of your score, like uh, your splash, you hit true. Okay? And I'll show you what that looks like. So now that we have all that set up, we're going to hit play. And this is what it's going to look like. I'm recording three screens, so it's going to take a second. But there we go. Everything's set up. And as you see on my DMD, there's videos popping up. Now when we hit play, there's a regular DMD with a score at the bottom. You'll see. There's your video, score, everything looks good. Alright. There you go. Hope that helps you guys out. It's just as simple as that. And that will help you on some other tables too. Like I said, make sure your screens are correct. Make sure you don't have anything scaled. Um, and that will set your Batman up. Okay? If you got any questions, you can drop it down below. But that should pretty much get you going. Make sure your Bat files check um, for your setup. Make sure you edited the script. Um, you have your table and put back in the right location and all that and test it in VPX beforehand. And uh, that's it. Hope you guys have a good night. Hope they helped you out. Till next time.